Duke this Wednesday in the big game of the week. Okay, Rick, thanks. When we come back, we're going to introduce you to some folks who take their Sunday walk very seriously. Stay with us. Sooner or later, weekday morning with two shows that'll fit right into your routine. Morning with John Hudson and Greg Fischel and CBS This Morning with Harry Smith and Kathleen Sullivan. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. They'll get your day started right with a healthy helping of news and timely information. Going to meet three working women of the year. So roadblocks in both east and Why, west. you'd feel empty if you left home without it. So tune in to the morning combo as you start your day. Morning and CBS This Morning. Weekdays from 6.30 to 9 on WRAL TV 5. Olympic hopefuls from all over the country were in the triangle today. They were here competing in the National Race Walk Championship. The 31-mile race was held in the Research Triangle Park, and many of those competing today qualified for the U.S. Olympic Race Walk Trials in April. It's kind of an individual sport, but we've got three, three guys in the top 20 in the world, basically, right now, and, and how hard they work and luck of the draw will see if they get better than that. So it's kind of what our chances are. Carl Schuler was the winner of today's race. His time, four hours, two minutes, and 35 seconds. Is race walking that difficult? I don't, it's a, I don't see it that often. It's an I endurance think. sport. Yeah, I mean, yeah. so. It's easier on your joints and stuff. It's supposed to be great running. exercise because it's smooth, but it's pretty hard okay, to keep running. And that was running. the first time it's ever been held here, right? Okay. Well, yeah, you're not asking a... an expert at race walking, but <laughs> okay. I'll take your word for I, it. I think it was the first time the championships have ever been held in North Carolina. <laughs> Thank you for joining us tonight. The CBS News is next with Susan Spencer. We'll be back tonight at 11, and we hope you will too. Good night.